Good readings and welcome, fellow Dragon Knights, to another episode of Let's Play Divinity 2. Alright. So I went to look where that particular key was, and I think I can find it. So it's being very cleverly hidden somewhere near here. Yeah, in the glow. Which I admit, that's very clever. I would never have thought to look there. Very well done, Larian. Don't do that again. can drive a man mad mad enough to start doing let's plays all right well that's very nice I'm not gonna be using that but it's very nice I think that's pretty much that we're done here. It's a minor challenge, a neat break in this diverse world. And we're close to leveling up, so it's nice. But I think we need to start worrying about uh, getting into the Orbas Fjords proper. Because right now we've basically just scratched the surface. And not even get anywhere close to any real challenge. Of course, the Black Ring is a little bit ahead of me on that. I cannot take my dragon form here. Right. And there is a ceiling, alright. Uh, my battle island. It looks so magnificent, but... Nothing I can do over there. Alright, so... If I want to get into the valley, I could ignore all this. But then, you notice, there's force fields here as well. And that's no good. Alright, while we're at it, I should probably get my skill in place. And let's get the fire sphere up. Alright, so... can't damage them while they're inside that thing which is a pity arise my pet So this uh, force field is really only dangerous for us if we are in dragon form. So let's not be in dragon form. Alright, so... Yeah, my muscular strength is almost unbelievable. The rumors abound in your home village about how your mother must have slept with an incarnate god or demon. Mm. Oh yes. Uh, I would like some wisdom at this stage, actually. 
But let's focus on doing damage instead. Because I'm already getting plenty of wisdom from uh, mostly, mostly passive buffs. I think that's probably fine. Alright, so we found a key. Dance, Necro Dancer. The Lancer. You can hide, but you can't run. Fatality. Oh, I just clear this beach of black rain. Just making sure we got everything done. Oh, there's uh, just ducks. <laughs> Thought enemies? No. Uh, for a moment I was thinking about playing uh, some Elder Scrolls game again. Mud crabs everywhere, but there's no mud crabs in this game. I've not seen any crabs. And there's an invisible wall. Alright. We've cleared this up. Now the thing about those force fields is they have uh, a power source and a control center, I think. So we need to find them. We can turn them off and get rid of all this junk. So I'm pretty sure I can't turn into a dragon here without killing myself. And that's not fun for anyone now, is it? Mm. All right. Let's see if there's anything we can see over here that is potentially relevant to our quest. No, ghost. no. I'll have to walk. All right. Arise. Now, they have sort of cleverly hidden the uh, locations for their uh, control centers. And that they are somewhat difficult to spot. Whoops. But there they are. That looks like it's well protected. Probably for good reason. Alright, so we can't enter there. But it does seem that it has a, uh, a finite protection. Hmm. Some bandits that didn't realize they couldn't stay here the night. Well, I can't get in there anyway at this stage. I think that locks me completely, regardless of the form I'm in. Let's see where this teleporter leads us. This teleporter has Camp Sentinel View written on it. Its destination is Camp Eagle's Nest. The control panel has been destroyed. You step away. All right. And this is indeed where we wanted to go. Thank you, Ben, for Black Ring for making this so much easier. Uh, I can't loot any of these chests. And we are on the right side of the ladder. Let's hope we can find some decent loot in here. And potentially a way to shut down the force fields. Well, 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 my love. Look who we have here. Why? It is the Dragon Knight, my dear. Ensnared by the Black Ring and unable to shapeshift into its fire-spewing self. 
This wouldn't do me any good anyway. You would just disappear and I couldn't fire brief over your corpses as much as I wanted to. How kind the serpent is, my sweet, to so openly walk into our little trap, almost like it wants to be slaughtered. Hmm. Quite considerate indeed, my darling. Which is why I would suggest we return the courtesy. You're always the gentleman, my cherished, and I quite agree. Come, let us see what music it makes when we pierce its flesh. Then we'll drink its blood by the fire, my precious, and make jubilant love. Go get him, boy! Yeah, this is not an episode of Dragon Slay and Chill. But I will take some consumables to make this a little bit easier. Let's drink some Allen Brew. And let's also get some potions in here. Solves one problem. All right. Mm. I'm finding some good loot now. Shiny. Please don't hurt me. The nightmares. Will the nightmares ever cease? Shh, it's okay, I'm here to rescue you. Oh, to find me praised. I'm Olivia Slayer, captain of this little citadel, until my entire command was wiped out today. All right, that would explain why the Black Ring has such a haphazard location. Still. I thank you for saving me, and please feel free to take anything you may find useful in this room. Ah, I was going to do that anyway, but thanks for the permission. I shall travel back to Alaroth. But before I go, is there anything you want to ask of me? How did the Blank Ring manage to overtake you? They came from within. A portal opened, and there they were. Before I even saw a definite shape, all lay dead in dark red pools. I was spared by their leaders. But only to serve in some perverse ritual later. It would have been of indescribable horror. Tell me about those teleports I found. Oh, they can be found all over the fjords. Oribus, the Dragon Knight who ruled here before the Great War, had them installed to allow fast and safe travel through the region. Your order banned the use of all devices connected to dragons, but Augustus, Alaroth's most senior champion, allowed us to operate them anyway. I don't know how you feel about that, but I'd advise you to either make use of them, or be prepared to do a lot of walking and dangerous climbing. Goodbye and good luck, Captain. Divine blessing, Slayer. Another one to add to the collection. Alright. I'll take everything I can. And... ooh, history of the damned. No. That's neat, but not immediately relevant. Another one to add to the collection. Alright, nothing in there. Alright, let's check upstairs. Not sure if there's anything upstairs to be worried about, but no, yep. Halt. You win, dragon. We surrender. What? No we won't, you rotten coward! <laughs> The dragon just killed Lord John and Lady Kara. You really think we can take it down? Uh, uh, yeah. Um, we surrender. 
uh, and will trade with you. I have unique magics to offer. And I, the best the ringsmiths can fashion. Fine, stand back, don't touch a thing in this bunker anymore and you'll live. We have a deal, dragon. May it be the damned one's will. <laughs> Pretty sure Damien would uh, pull your intestines out through your noses if he found out, but, you know. Alright, some amber. I don't mind having some extra shops that I can offload my crap to. Let's see. Shiny. All right, so that should turn off the force field. All right. I think I already have that formula, but just make use of it anyway. Hmm. I kind of hoped for more. Is it trading you're after? Let's read your mind. Lost. It found the girl. I never get a break. <laughs> yeah, he wanted to do something perverse to it. To her, rather. Tell me about the Black Ring presence here. We were sent because of you. Sent to slay the serpent. Damien the Great chose the King and Queen of Poenari Castle. The mighty couple to have the honor of your blood. But he did not expect you to be so strong, and neither did Lord John and Lady Cara. United now in death. Show me your wares. If I must. Yes, you must. Alright, so what do you have? Oh, damn, I have to do math again. Um. Well. Overall, this weapon isn't too bad. It's expensive, though. Um, on base damage, it does more than the current sword I have. And aside from the critical chance, it's just it doesn't have any um, magic damage. I don't think I want to trade away all the magic damage I want. Especially since both of these only have one enchantment slot, which is a little low. You don't particularly have any interesting gear. And I wasn't going to be using this anyway. I'll just take some gold from you because you have plenty. Uh, right. Uh, we were definitely gonna upgrade at some stage, but I wasn't quite finding the gear I wanted for that. Alright, so, oops. Yes? What? Keep clicking the wrong buttons, that's, that's absolutely not what I want to do. Uh, let's see. Uh, these pants are just pants. So they'll be rid of. Not gonna be selling any dragon gear. Um, no. I mean, as good as some of these talismans are, I'm not going to be replacing the scorpion necklace. Yeah, the power belt is probably going to be replaced soon because I can put some better charms on that one. There's not really a change between these two. Uh, so, well, I guess I got rid of you because I like the legendary tag better. Uh, mana regeneration, that's not as good for me. I mean, it's fun to have, but... Alright, uh, yeah, that is totally useless to me.
forever. Oh shush. Alright, well we'll continue this next time. Thank you all for watching. See you all then.